Hello, I am Lene St. John of the Mamasutra.net for what they are asking. And this week's top voted question was the following. I was told I am too fat for birth control. What are my options? Okay, I have to be honest. My initial reaction to this question was, who says this stuff to people? Um, I'm not sure if it was a medical professional or just a body shaming fat phobic person that said that to you, but no one is too fat for birth control. First of all, let me take a step back to say this. I want to stress how important it is for all of you watching that you know your status and that you're able to communicate your STI status with your partner. Um, I'm not sure from the question if the people involved are fluid bonded, so I will say this. The only method of birth control that will provide protection from STIs like HIV, chlamydia, syphilis, etc. are condoms, and that includes the female condom. And I'm speaking specifically to sexual behaviors including oral, anal, and vaginal sex. That said, there are many other methods of birth control that can help to protect you from getting pregnant. Note, these all have varying rates of effectiveness and rely greatly on following your doctor's instructions for its use to the letter. Going back to your question, for hormonal birth control, it may be possible that the effectiveness of the hormones may be reduced, but it does not in any way mean you can't use birth control. For examples aside from hormonal birth control or the pill, as I said before, there are many options. Abstinence is essentially refraining from any sexual activity at all. Um, outer course is another option, and that's essentially non-penetrative sex, so heavy petting, mutual masturbation, things like that. Um, there's the sponge, the cervical cap, or the diaphragm. There's the IUD, or the intrauterine device. And there's also sterilization for those people who know right now that they don't want to have set, um, don't want to have children when they um, in the future. And that's just to name a few. Now, as always, regardless of what your weight is, condoms are always a possibility. Planned Parenthood has a great widget on their website that is there to help you identify the methods of birth control that fit your lifestyle. Um, you can Google Planned Parenthood My Access to find this tool. You can use a combination of birth control methods to increase your coverage. For example, using the pill and a condom. But please, do not combine a condom with the female condom. Not going to work. Not a good idea. Okay, so here comes the disclaimer. I am not a medical doctor, and the information I'm sharing in this video is not intended to replace the advice of your own physician. Um, you should feel absolutely comfortable talking to your physician, talking to your own OBGYN about this topic, about birth control. If you find you're not meshing with your OBGYN, maybe ask your friends for a recommendation. Um, in my book, it's not okay to work with someone who makes you feel bad about yourself. Um, this is your health, your sexual health we're talking about here, and so it really is it's incredibly important that you be able to speak to your doctor about this topic. Thanks again for your question. We'll see you next time on whattheyareasking.com. I'm Lene St. John of the Mamasutra.net. Bye for now.